Okay, so today Camille and I are going to be doing the sister tag, which is just a series of 22 questions. Question number one, how old are you both? Um, I'm 18. And I'm 16. Describe each other in one word. How do you describe me? Fierce. Fierce? Really? I would describe you as kind of um, quirky though. Is that bad? Or mm -hmm. I think it's cute. Like, you're a little cute, cute quirky. Yeah. Number three, do people ever get you mixed up? Um, yes. Our mom does. Yeah. The names. And on the phone, we get mistaken yeah. a lot. Like, and a lot our voices of, sound similar. A I lot guess. of relatives get us mixed up too. Yeah. What is something that annoys you about one another? Sometimes you're really loud, but how often you're not here. Yeah. But I know that you can't always help it all the time. Number five, what is it like being sister with a YouTube guru? Well, I'm not a YouTube guru, so. Being your sister and having you be involved with like YouTube and all that stuff, I think it's fun because you like to think that it's awkward that you do it and stuff and I kind of like to be there and support you and yeah. I don't know. You think it's weird that you make videos and I think it's cool. So Number six, do you ever argue? Yeah, a lot. Yeah. Well, not like a lot, a lot. Yeah. I'm not here, but like we argue pretty frequently. Number seven, what is the best thing about one another? Ooh. I think um, your people skills are amazing. I've talked, I've told you about this. I admire how good you are with people, like how you talk to other people and stuff, and I'm just so yeah. nervous. That, and you're really good at keeping conversations going. I think uh, the best thing about you is probably like your sense of humor. Like, I don't know, you have a really like interesting sense of humor. It's not like a typical, you know. Ditch the dirt? Uh, that, yeah, what? Does that mean like tell a secret? Um, I don't know. We're sure, but I don't even know. Yeah, what. I don't know any secrets about you. Number nine, favorite inside joke. Okay. Spill milk. Oh yeah, the spill milk one. Yeah. Should we tell them the actual joke? Like what sure. happened? Okay. So I was getting milk out of the fridge. It was a while ago, and I had a white mug, and I filled it all the way to the very, very top. And Stella, for some unknown reason, thought that the the mug was upside down. Picked that it is up not what happened. And dumped it everywhere. That's yes, not what it is. No, it was the kitchen, ta our kitchen table, and there was a mug sitting there, and then there was another mug on top of it that somebody had put there. I I remember doing this. Because why would there be a mug on top of it? And I thought that it was upside down, and I. It was full of milk. And it had, it was like halfway full of milk. I think the one that you're talking about was a different incident. Possibly. Favorite memory together. I don't know, one of my favorites is traveling with you. Like going yeah. to New York and going Ukraine. to Ukraine and uh, going on the road trip. Yeah. To California. Yeah. yeah, that was great. It was all those road trips. But we have a lot of like, I have a lot of memories from like being younger that I love with you. Like driving around in our little Barbie car and stuff. Yeah. So it's hard to just like pick one. The traveling. Probably. Traveling. Number 11, full sisters, half or step? We are full mm -hmm. sisters. We're half sisters. Just kidding. So We're full sisters. Yeah, through and through. Guess each other's favorite singer. I don't know yours either. You know all these like people I've never even Alex heard of. Alex Turner. You like Alex Turner. But I don't know if he's like that. I would say that he's your favorite because you just love his voice. That's why yeah. I would say he's your favorite singer. He doesn't necessarily have to be like your favorite band. Yeah. For you, I don't know. Black Bear? I'll just mm -hmm. that. I'll love him then. He's not my favorite singer. He doesn't really sing that much. Singer, Beyonce. Her voice is golden. She does have a hell of a really voice. Is. But um, I'd probably go Jack White. Or I, mean, I know you like him, but I really guess that was your like favorite singer. He's, he's I really like David Bowie, Bowie too, and Frank Sinatra, and mm -hmm. the Beatles. I wouldn't count Black Bear because he doesn't really sing, but I do like his music. Yeah, like, I really like his music, but yeah, there's a lot of like random people that I don't even know their names that I really enjoy. So. Number thirteen, who takes longer to get ready? Definitely her. Me. I'm really, really tired. We had to wait today for me to get ready so that we could actually film this video. Yeah, and then you started an episode of Criminal Minds and we had to wait even longer. It's whatever though, we're doing it now. That's yeah. all that matters. Um, yeah, how long do you take to get ready in the morning, what do you say? So you like an hour to the end. An hour and a half then. Yeah, Because I take hour. about, I take about an, half an hour to 15 minute showers every day. You're killing the planet, you know. I'm sorry. Heels are flat. Flat. I would say heels for me. I like, I like heels. I like Just because I like the way they look yeah, and the way, yeah, like, yeah. I like walking in them when it's happening. Yeah. Like, I like, I like the, the way they make heels. you feel. Yeah, I like the look of heels, but I can't wear them. I don't know how to walk in them, and they're just impractical to me. I, I don't really like flats either, though. I'm more of, like, a sneakers. I do All wear, time. yeah, I wear, like, Converse. That's, like, my go-to yeah. shoe. Number 15, pants or dresses? Pants. I like dresses though. Okay, if but we're you like, pants, like I, I wear pants. pants right now. I wear pants all the time, like every day. If or you had like to pick shorts, you for know, like whatever. the rest of your life, dresses or pants? For the rest 
to my life dresses because then you could you could dress up or dress down. You could dress up pants. Yeah, but it's more difficult. I would like dresses yeah, more so. for the rest of my life. They're way more comfortable. This one, um, you probably will not guess about me and I don't even know if I can guess about you. I think I do, but yours changes all the time. Um, favorite animal. You told me that you don't have one. Yeah, I really don't. Like, I like them all. There are so many that I can appreciate and like different things. And like, it's hard to, for me to choose one. And I think yours is a cat or a unicorn. So oh, yeah. I'm more away from the unicorn thing. Yeah, it's more cats I mean, and pigs. Unicorns always this. They do, but I mean, they're like number three. Cats, pigs, unicorns. What would my favorite animal be? I don't know. Let's go. I like with... big cats. I think panthers are really beautiful, and like leopards. Like that's just like the snow leopard and wolves are really pretty like i don't know i like she's just moping around the hi come on hi. 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 Oh, so cute. 17. if your house was burning down and your entire family was sure to be okay what would you save and why oh, fuck. i would go upstairs and i'd get all my journal and no you just get one no I'd get all my journals. Uh, okay, so it does say what would you say, so I guess all of it. So yeah. I get my journals, which I have Oh like no! Three. Why are we messing with it? I don't know. I'm... She just broke her bracelet. I would get my journals. Then I'd, probably uh, grab my, I'd probably grab my. No. I'd probably grab my memory drawer. It's not a drawer, it's a box. I mean, and then I'd probably get like my laptop and my camera and stuff like that too. I would save my camera. Oh, and my nail polish. Oh, I just shove all that into a bag and try to get as many of them as I could. Okay, my turn. Okay, the things that I would save from our burning house would be my Nikon camera, my cell phone, chargers, my laptop, and the makeup and, yes, a couple, several CDs. 18, comedy, horror, or chick flick? I'd say that depends on my, like, mood. Yeah, like, I'm yeah, into. yeah. I like, sometimes like, I'm really just in the mood for horror movies, but other times it's like, no, like, I hate scary movies, but I'd sometimes say that I'm I, just in the mood for them. I feel horror movies more than I feel anything else. Yeah. <laughs> I like I'd comedies, say, though. Comedies are always good. Um, Sisters was really good. I really yeah. like that because we were like, mm -hmm. that was really good. That's we related to that one a lot. Number 19, Android or iPhone? iPhone. iPhones are just like aesthetically beautiful, right? I hate Apple because they make you get all these stupid updates. Yeah. I barely have any storage or blah, 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 blah. Like, There's so many drawbacks. They're but they are the mm -hmm. easiest to use because they are the yeah. most normal. And like they the know that amount of people so have So that's them. why they take advantage of it. Okay, number 20. What is something weird that you eat? Pickles and peanut butter. For me? Yeah. Mm. That's not like a reason. It is. To I me, know. I've seen you eat it before and it's weird. Yeah, I like it though. It's good. Um, I'd say something that is weird that I eat pretty much every single day is cottage cheese and a cinnamon raisin bagel with on nothing it? on it. No. Oh, you just I eat the together. cinnamon raisin bagel weird. by itself, and then I eat cottage cheese yeah. by itself. That's not together. weird. For you, I would say all your vegetarian stuff. Like what? I'm just kidding. You eat well mayonnaise and cheese sandwiches. That's gross. And I weird. don't do that's that really anymore. Weird. I, I was feeling like right after I became vegetarian, I was just, just like feeling healthy. There's, there's nothing that I can eat. eat. There's nothing. I eat. Eat. So I used to eat like I used to eat like salami with cheese and mayonnaise. So I was just like, let's just take out the salami. Twenty one. Twenty one. Do you guys have anything to match? Yeah, yeah. You have that one shirt. I remember you made me buy this and you haven't worn it since. We haven't worn them together since. But I didn't know this because I see it in my dresser every day. You have that one shirt that says, I woke up like this. Yeah. And I have that gray tank top that says, I doubt you woke up like that. Yeah, we're not. supposed to wear it together. They don't really match, but they We do have a lot of the same shirts um, from Hawker like, and stuff and also from yeah. OXCR. So we have a lot of matching things that way. And I guess we have other things that like go together on that part out. <laughs> I'm so tired. I am so tired. Your turn. Your turn. All right. 22. What is your favorite TV show? What is your favorite For TV you? show? For you, I'd say like Cutthroat Kitchen and you like all kinds of like cooking shows. Yeah, uh -huh. you like Criminal Minds. Mine is like Lost. Okay, wrong. You completely forgot about Bob's Burgers, 30 Rock, SNL, you forgot about all of them. Yours would be like Lost and The Office, I think you like. Yeah. Right? You like the cooking shows too. What else? That's it. That's, That's it? it. All right. Oh, and Freaks and Geeks. Yeah. Yes. So that's all the time we have for today. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. It's been real. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.